Well, Happy New Year, everybody. Uh, welcome to 2015. It's, it's good to uh, spend a little few minutes with you this afternoon. I hope you've had a great holidays, and I hope your New Year's off to a good start. I just wanted to take a few minutes and give you a few little bits of information and update. Um, first of all, next week on Monday, January the 12th, is the swearing-in ceremony of all of our new constitutional officers in our state, including certainly Governor Deal. That happens at 2 o'clock on Monday afternoon, so we begin also a new legislative session. So the Georgia General Assembly convenes also on Monday the 12th. So next week, things will begin to pick up from a legislative perspective. Uh, I don't know if there's a lot of legislative activity that I can preview for you because I'm not aware of it, but uh, we will keep you posted as, as the year unfolds. But just to let you know that that's going to be happening. The other thing I want to give you a little update on is uh, I mentioned to you in the last video about the new law, the Workforce Innovation and Opportunity Act, WIOA. And what I said to you last time is that our understanding is that the federal regulations about the implementation of the law were supposed to be issued on January the 18th. Unfortunately, we have all learned this week that the regulations, the draft regulations, have been delayed until the spring of 2015. So we really won't know until this spring what the full impact of that potentially new law that's going to affect, in particular, VR a lot what they will be, but they should come out in the spring. Uh, the core poor programs, sorry about that, the core programs that are part of the WIOA, Workforce Development, Adult Education, Department of Labor, uh, Adult and Youth Services, and GVRA through the VR program. And then lastly, probably the one thing I wanted to share with you just this afternoon is just that reminder that with this month in January, we start the year that is the 25th anniversary of the signing and passage of the Americans with Disabilities Act. The ADA was passed in 1990, so here we are in 2015, 25 years later. I'm sure that you've probably seen in John's daily update bits and pieces about the ADA and the 25th anniversary, but this is a big year. It really celebrates kind of the civil rights law for folks with disabilities. So. Uh, we applaud that they've made it 25 years. We have a long way to go, but just wanted to bring that to your attention. I look forward to hopefully speaking with you more frequently and looking forward to a great new year. Thank you for all you do.